Hey YouTube, what's going on? Brandon here with another YouTube video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use the um, uninstall feature for some of the programs on your computer for Windows 10. Really, let me just explain uh, what this is going to do for your computer. A lot of times most of the programs on your computer are not necessary. A lot of them are just downloaded by default and a lot of these companies have already just by default even the, the, the antivirus, a lot of these other programs are put on here. Just by default, you're, they're not necessary at all unless you're paying for them and even then uh, Windows has enough security to where you don't need those programs and those security programs, antivirus security programs are the ones that really take up most of the space and those are the ones you're really going to want to remove right away. So this is going to help your computers, uh, you know, fa load faster, you know, uh, start up faster. So it's something that you really, really need to consider doing. And over time, you know, as time goes on, sometimes you download things and you forget to uninstall them. So, you know, just make sure that you come back and make sure that you do that, you know, semi-annually so that your computer is running properly. So what you're going to do is you're going to click the start button here. You're going to go to the settings and then you've got apps here. This is Windows 10 only. And you're going to come down here. I don't need this game, so I'm going to uninstall it. Uninstall, just like that. For a lot of these, a lot of times it's going to ask you for the um, admin password. So you're going to want to make sure to have that. Uh, this one, I don't even know what this is. I, I see it pop up all the time, but I know it's not necessary. So just like this. I'm going to go ahead and put in my password. And that's going to come right off there. Yeah, so a lot of these, they're, they're not necessary. You know, this is just taking up space. It's taking up, um, you know, the speed from your computer, and you don't want that. So that's really all it is. Um, as far as what you need to keep and what you don't need to keep necessarily, you know, like a lot of these things, this uh, graphics driver, that's something you do not want to, you know, um, get rid of. Now, I won't cover that in this video. Yeah, so for a list of things that you want to keep and, you know, things that you can remove, go ahead and Google it. You know, go to Google, go to uh, Google Chrome, go to Chrome and, uh, you know, figure out what you should remove and what needs to absolutely stay on the computer. There's a lot of uh, resources out there that will help you with that. The more you can remove, the more stuff you realize that you're not using. Look at this. This is something from 2008. I don't need that. I just don't need it. So there's a lot of things like this that you can remove and so that your computer is just running faster. If your computer is really slow and you've got a desktop, you can also buy some RAM from Amazon.com. Uh, I'm going to leave a link in the description below for that. So if you were wanting to buy some more memory for your desktop, um, go ahead and type in the type of desktop you have and you can find your, your memory uh, RAM card on Amazon.com. I highly recommend that you do that. Go ahead and check out that link in the description below. So that's really all, it is, all there is to it. You know, this takes some time. Sometimes, as you see here, it's going to take a little bit of loading time. So, you know, set some time aside for yourself to do this properly and to completely do everything that remove everything you want to remove so that you have a fresh start and your computer is running the way it's supposed to again. So I hope this video was helpful. Please make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel have a lot of helpful videos for printers, computers, and a lot of other tips on, you know, making money online. So make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, comment below if you have any questions at all. Thanks for watching, and until next time.